Steiniger plays it. Here's Heitkamp, going to get an opportunity. She put it away! The New Bremen volleyball team calls themselves state champions once again, taking home their first repeat title. Every state championship is so special, but living in the moment is such a key and it's so critical. Um, this one was really, really special. We faced so much adversity this year, and I'm just proud of my team, my community, for coming together and playing our best when it mattered the most. It's kind of just indescribable. I mean, it's we worked so hard this year and in, in the preseason that it's just so rewarding. You know, you always want to end your career on a good note, so definitely ending back-to-back -back state champs, it's kind of surreal feeling. I don't really know how to explain it, but it's awesome. The Cardinals took down Tiffin Calvert in the finals, a team New Bremen considers a true rival. We faced them twice in the state finals, once in regional finals. We scrimmage them every summer. We know how good they are. And to finally come on top in the, that final match means a lot to us because we have so much respect for their program and um, what they're doing over there. This marks six finals appearances in seven years, four of them resulting in a state title for the Cardinals, making the new Bremen volleyball program a modern day dynasty in the state of Ohio. You know, it's kind of crazy because like I started off as managing when they first won their state championship. So it's like I kind of seen how it all grew because my sister played um, also. So, you know, I just kind of saw it grow. And now where it's at now, it's just kind of, again, so real. Like, just crazy. The amount of hard work that these girls put in, it's just unbelievable. The amount of time the coaching staff puts in, the dedication that it takes to get to this level, um, it's just unbelievable. And getting to the top is really hard staying at the top and living up to all those expectations year in and year out. It's, it's unbelievable. It's, it's humbling, it's exhausting. It's um, just keeps you going. There's no finish line. A talented senior class anchored the team led by Olivia Heitkamp. They were like my children. They're like my daughters. I love them. And they're great leaders on the court, off the court. They taught the younger girls how to join in, but they also let some of the underclassmen be leaders also, which is really cool. They weren't demeaning. They weren't. Um, they were. They embraced the underclassmen and allowed them to also lead by example. It's that expansive group of underclassmen that must now put New Bremen on track to that elusive three-peat. I think it all comes down to like accountability and like not only like towards like yourself but your teammates and just making sure that we're like doing the things but doing them right and with care because it's about the little things. The juniors just officially became seniors in my eyes. Everybody graduated already, even though graduation doesn't happen until May. Um, the senior class will be really strong. The junior and sophomore classes, they just are learning by example. And our eighth grade class went undefeated this year. So there's going to be talent on all levels and competition is going to be incredibly high these next nine months. In New Bremen, Jack McGuire, WOSN. And the New Bremen Cardinals win back-to-back -back state championships, this time in set number four, 25-16. They took set number three, 25-22. Tiffin Calvert won the, mid, the second set, 28-26. But New Bremen had won the first set, 25-22. And the New Bremen Cardinals can celebrate.